Hi guys, this is Alyssa. Um, I'm the senior beauty editor at Couturesque Magazine and today I will be showing you how to recreate the glossy eyelid trend. Um, so as you can see, I'm already wearing my complexion, um, my foundation, my blush, um, bronzer, contour, uh, my eyebrows, um, and I have a little bit of eyeliner on as well as mascara because this look is pretty much, it's really easy to do and really easy to create. So it only really needs a couple products. To get started, I am going to be placing um, a cream eyeshadow on my lid and I'm gonna go for a more natural look. I will be taking this color here, which is a very um, champagne pink color. And I'll be placing that on the lid. The reason I'm picking a cream eyeshadow versus a powder is that the, the gloss will tend to stay and mix a little bit better versus using a powder in my experience. So I'm going to go ahead and place that right on the center of my lid and then blending it outwards and upwards into the crease. For anyone who is um, heavily lidded or um, heavily creased, you can place it right on the center of, the, of your mobile part of your lid as well um, and then move it up into the crease. Um, especially for anyone who is monolidded, you can actually bring it right up to the brow bone to kind of create that highlighted effect. And then here comes the good part. So I will be mixing a gloss, a clear gloss, with a balm. And you can use any sort of balm. Um, I prefer rose salve because I like the smell. You can also use Vaseline. I am going to take some rose salve and bring it and just put it on the back, a little bit on the back of my hand. Then I'm going to take a little bit of gloss. I would recommend if you are sensitive to smells or to certain ingredients that you do read the ingredients for your gloss. It's all about the placement. With this look, the right placement will give you the glossiest look without having too much product on you. Right on the center of the lid. So that's really where my, my lid is very round, so it's really where you'll see the effect. And then you, I'm going to be placing some right underneath my brow. And rather than smearing it across, really just placing it and patting it on, and then dabbing a little bit right in the center. And there you go. Easy peasy.